it just seemed like it'd be an experience and definitely help with my writing. But it just, what drew me in was the photography part. <laughs> I just love taking pictures on my free time. Well, at Quinn, I t was like a part of the journalism club, which was like just starting out there. And I thought that was really fun. And I always just like had an interest kind of in journalism and like publishing. And in like at Quinn, we weren't able to interview people. But then my mom was like, yeah, you should take the class because like I'd be forced into social situations. And like before the class, I was like really awkward and antisocial and like wouldn't raise my hand in class. And like now I kind of raise my hand in class. And I like sometimes talk to people more. And like I just talk to like adults more and sometimes other students that I wouldn't usually talk to. You know, if I talk to friends that don't work in a high school, they're like, how can, sometimes they're, how can you work with teens? And it's, teens do have a voice. I mean, if anyone's read The Outsider, she wrote that when she was 16. So I think that this is a platform that's outside of the classroom that's actually published where teens can have their voices heard and reflect the community that they're reporting on. I didn't expect people to read it. And like, I first remember like people talking about my articles when it was my editorial on like, the mental health should be like equal to physical health. And like people started talking about that and the teachers were like starting to pay more attention to like, that sort of thing. Like I remember Ms. Vessels was saying how like they talked about it in a teacher meeting or something along the lines of that. And I just found that like really like powerful that my thoughts in the class, my thoughts could like be shared and also like be recognized where they weren't necessarily recognized before that. The nice thing about the news is we really look through those values of like, is it timely, is it current, is there interest, is there a conflict we can cover, does it have an oddity to it. So it is really an opportunity to not just um, be stuck on something and have a predicted like this is exactly what we're doing. This might be a great opportunity for you to learn about something you've never heard of before, research it, interview people who are experts in that area, and then produce a writing on it. You like get really close with the people that are in the class like pretty quickly. It's like you work with everyone. It's kind of a team building class. And if you like don't have a lot of friends or if you like don't know what to do, I feel journalism is a way you can do it. This day and age, I think that our freedom of speech is under attack. And I think that there is so much media out there that students have a hard time, not even students, but just citizens in general, have a hard time differentiating between what's real and what is fake news. Um, to be an educated um, group of citizens, we really need to know where to find valuable information out there. It definitely advanced your thinking. I think a lot differently now. Just like the, the topics we have brought up or like just the writing piece of it has also helped a lot, but it would really advance you like educationally and just mindset. I guess it's just like going through, so going through like the news and everyday thing. We do this like almost every day. We just go through the news on a daily basis and going over certain articles, we have like a huge group discussion about it and it sometimes is awkward, sometimes it's a good thing, sometimes it's a bad thing, but it just opens your mind to like what the world really is and how things have happened and what is changing the world today. I think if you want to get better in writing, but you want to do it in a situation where you could be writing things that are topics you're interested in. This is a great class to explore that in. This is a great class for you to overcome any um, anxiety you might have about talking to people. A big component of the class is really interviewing people and not just being okay with one interview, but going up and making people feel comfortable to tell their story. I mean, we're, at the end of the day, we're dealing with human pieces. Even though it's covering news and it's a nice story, we're dealing with what it is to be human and we're covering who are the humans within Hudson. Um, so I think that if you have a curious mind and you want to practice your writing, this would be the class for you.